Well, 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 what do we have here? Dissension in the ranks, WWE Network, lawsuits, royalties, money, authority, want to be seen. Welcome to the Supreme and Sean's View Entertainment. To help support this channel, click the link below to support and donate. Or leave your comments, likes, click that bell and subscribe. That all helps Sean's View Entertainment in the development and growth of this channel. Your comments are read, realized, and recognized. And please share this video all over Twitter and Facebook. Let's get right into the WWE news, rumors, and headlines where I work around the clock. And please check out the three to four videos previous to this one. Huge reports and news going on in WWE at this hour. The latest development in the ongoing battle between WWE and the various wrestlers suing them today in the form of WWE filing a motion to dismiss the action fi uh, filed by Marcus Buff Bagwell and Scott Raven Levy. This is the case dealing with WWE Network royalties and there are two prongs to it. Number one, that WWE has a legal obligation to pay both wrestlers royalties for WCW footage in general. Levy's 2000 WWF contract, because it allows for royalties from videos released in formats yet to be invented and did not specifically exempt royalties from internet and video on-demand subscription fees the way current WWE contracts do. WWE's motion to dismiss deals with each is simple yet highly detailed fashion. WWE's response to this, WWE does not fall under any legal criteria that would make it a successor company to WCW. If just because the legal entity formerly known as WCW still exists as the Universal Wrestling Corporation, both plaintiffs' WCW contracts also saw them forego video royalties in exchange for other considerations. The, th the key language in the contracts is that royalties come from a direct sale of WWE home video products, with the references to technology not yet invented referring to formats like Blu-ray. It didn't exist at that time of contract, but like VHS, LaserDisc, and DVD, it's a physical product that can be sold and resold. There's also a detailed argument about how there's legal pre precedent saying that a sale refers to a physical product, not a temporary license like a WWE Network subscription is. WWE attorney Jerry McDevitt also points out that a WWE contract's royalty structure is pretty much impossible to apply to the WWE Network. And I'm sorry, and I know I'm going to get a lot of hate for this, but I agree with the WWE on this one. And I, I, I think they're just looking for, you know, money. Obviously, it's a money issue. But then you can say that Sean Dream is looking for money. But I was on here long before contracts and money was handed out like candy. But that's just to help my progress because I'm actually relevant today here on YouTube where I work around the clock to present you the news, the rumors, and headlines. But me and this story is not relative. Um, but viewers and subscribers, your comments and your opinions. Do you think Raven and Buff Bagwell are in the right? Listen, I was a big Raven fan. Raven was a hell of a character. Buff Bagwell, he was okay. Nothing too spectacular, nothing special. But, I mean, you know, you hear these wrestlers, you know, also suing for, you know, damages and lawsuits due to concussions. Now, WWE Network royalties. All these former names just coming out of the woodwork trying to be recognized and realized and trying to... You know, just get every little bit out of WWE that they can. But I think the WWE presents an even better argument here. And I think it's going to be tough to argue that. And, and it, listen, if Raven and Buff Bagwell do even get anything out of this, is it going to be anything that significant? Is it really something to go to battle, go to, to go to war over? I mean, you're going against the WWE, the World Wrestling Entertainment. Not, penny, not many people win in the lawsuits. And when you're trying to sue WWE, sue the WWE Network. Well, then that just brings a whole nother level where you don't want to be. Your comments, your opinions, click the link below, click the bell below. If you want to donate to my future on YouTube.com and, you know, making my dream become a reality, hit that donate button below or somewhere around this channel, somewhere around this video, above, below, or beyond, wherever it is. Your comments, your opinions, do you think Raven and Buff Bagwell deserve their royalties? And are you subscribed to the WWE Network? subscribe today and please share my videos and leave your likes because it's very crucial uh with youtube being broken thank you for watching more news and rumors to come from sean's view entertainment